What if it happened in the bedroom? How could that be possible? No, think about it. The professor kills John Brody using the knife and drags his body into the bedroom to hide it until morning. Wouldn't there be some kind of trail of blood or something leading to the bedroom? Well, not if he cleaned up afterward. Cleaned up afterwards? There were people all over the goddamn house. How could he clean up afterwards? Okay, you're right. Maybe he didn't stab Bodhi. Then what do you think happened? Because the fact remains that we have a very serious murder on our hands. And we're no closer to solving it while we're just sitting here and arguing. There's no doubt in my mind that it happened in the bedroom. I agree with that wholeheartedly. But where you start to go wrong is when you say it had to be a stabbing. Go on. Well, it had to be clean and leave little evidence, and especially no blood. Okay, so if it wasn't a stabbing, then what was it? Well, I think it had to be a strangulation, using a simple household rope. Now, that actually makes a great deal of sense. Also, it explains why nobody heard the screaming. Exactly. So are you ready to make an actual arrest? I believe that I am. Was it the gun? Was it in the study? Was it in the kitchen? Was it the candlestick? Was it Mr. Green? Was it Miss Scarlet? Was it the pipe? Was it the revolver? Was it in the billiards room? Was it the wrench? I'm ready to make a guess. Okay. It was the professor with a rope in the bedroom. 